No. I love. Is this on? I love Hack to Jack. I love Hack to Jack. Because it's helped me play better. It helps me play better. Feel better. Does this camera make my calves look bigger? Meet some great people. Meet some great people. This is fun. This is fun. Now this, this right here, this is fun. This is Hack to Jack. Is Hack to Jack. Hack to Jack. This is Hack to Jack. Welcome back, and man, are we having fun. Since the last episode, contestants have been working on their game, doing fun skills challenges, and forming their team strategies. Oh, and having a complete blast. Now, you've seen the auditions, you've met the contestants, and learned all about the Hack to Jack program. Let's check in to see how the contestants' games and lives are changing since they began several weeks ago. I'm doing great. So far, you know, I've been keeping up with the fitness, been putting my 10,000 steps in, 17 consecutive days. At this point, I've done nine pounds. I'm feeling great. Um, I feel like I've got more endurance when I'm going out and playing. For sure, the hardest thing is trying not to consume that much sugar. Like, you only get 30 grams, and that's like, that's that's beyond a pop. I never use Gizmos. I never even took a lesson before. So I'm actually utilizing all the tools that's given by the Hack to Jack uh, show. Some of our contestants have never picked up a club before the show. And some are single digit handicappers trying to get to that elusive scratch level. Let's see how things are going for our tour player wannabes. I've been playing for 20 years and I didn't know how to hit it. So uh, Tim actually showed me a lot about uh, basically where my club is grounding out. Kind of a, a big weight shift uh, problem that I was having and, and actually I, he gave me a lot of homework to work on. Some people playing some some pig with the converter holes over there, that's always fun and I'm more worried about uh, hitting the range with my PSP. I played around uh, the wilds last weekend, Scott and I, and, and uh, he only beat me by three strokes, which is a huge improvement for my game. And most of all, there were no club tosses. I had a, I had a blast the whole time, so it was great. As far as golf goes, it's always up and down, but you know, it's all about becoming more consistent. We just got our clubs fitted yesterday, so hopefully Super that excited. will help. It's been going, just uh, back to chipping, because that's like, uh, the worst part of my game. A lot of people when they hit behind fairway woods, long irons, uh, I guess irons in general, they tend to pick, hit the ground behind it, but we're looking in front of the ball so we can hit down on it. Yep. Making a little bit of progress already. From the two sessions you told me, I'm already feeling like I can hit the ball better and yeah, awesome. getting out yeah, there. Yeah, well, Ricky, Ricky's super fun to teach yeah. and um, he's in it, in it to win it, man. Yeah. <laughs> All right, looking good. Yeah, thank you. I've actually gained over 36 yards in distance from that machine last night. I absolutely kid you not, uh, it was all in my hip. So it was a huge increase in power for me. Uh, I can't wait to go back. A critical part of improving and being more consistent in golf is having clubs that properly fit. Let's see which lucky contestants have earned some new tools for the job. So the team we would like to present these to tonight is one individual who has no clubs, has never golfed before, and one individual who's playing with golf clubs from uh, like 1987. <laughs> All right, so in order to help them improve their game and uh, basically change their game, we would like to present the Callaway XR clubs to Tyler and... Yeah. Uh, yeah. 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 So you got some new Callaway Razor X. Yeah. All right, All right. Uh, Tyler, Callaway Bay. And then uh, you got a fancy uh, Bridgestone driver. Nice. Right. We've got Mike and Katie's club just came in. Uh, you know, I've been golfing my entire life and I've never actually had a new set of clubs. I have full belief that this will make me a pro golfer. And the bucket hat. No, uh, he made an announcement. The guy came in with a couple of bags and everybody else has been winning stuff so I just figured, uh, you know, it wasn't going to be us. Yeah, I can't. I have to admit, there was a little drool when I saw yeah, these babies come I, in. I was drooling, yeah. <laughs> this is pretty unbelievable. Starting back over a little bit, regressed a little for the winter. And um, it's coming back, especially with my new Bridgestone clubs. Wow, those make such a difference. And Ryan, uh, you are going to get fit for some new clubs today. So uh, what are you looking forward to most about the uh, experience here at Second Swing? Well, I need an upgrade. It's been uh, 10, 12 years since I've gotten new clubs, and the technology is just out of this world these days. And so it's about time to, to get with the times. Uh, I think it's incredible, the difference that it can make. Uh, it's not just a small amount, it's a large amount. and. Uh, 
I'm excited to see what we're gonna do with my, with my irons now, because my driver game's already all stepped up. And now for our favorite part of the show. Let's get out of the studio and head to the course for some fun skills challenges to see who wins prizes and has the most fun. All right, for our first contest tonight, we're here on the putting green out in Southern Hills, and uh, we're going to do putting wars. Oh, good putt! Go in. Three rip! <laughs> Woo! Cheaters. A bunch of cheaters. Oh! oh nice! <laughs> that was this is out. insane! Oh, that counts for us. You trying to talk crap yourself. to me? Yeah. Look at that yourself. Do you know who, who do you think you, you are? Do you know who I am? Hey, who do you Nike. think you are, Team Nike? I'm Team Second Swing. Do you want my autograph after this? All right, we're down to the championship round with the putting wars here. We've got Team Scott Goff versus Team Ruckett. Uh, let's see who wins and takes home the Fireside gift cards and the trophy. Yeah! Yeah! All right, our next contest here is the flop shot. So the contestant that hits it closest to the pin here on the green wins a $50 gift card to Second Swing. Oh, this could be good. Sit, sit, sit. Oh! <laughs> yeah! Is that safe to say that's the closest to the pin? <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> All right, for our next challenge tonight, we're doing pop the balloon. So we have the contestants at their stalls, and the first one to pop the balloon wins the prize. They're going to get two rounds of golf to Deer Run Golf Club. All right, for our next challenge, the contestants are going 100 yards out. The closest to the pin wins a $50 gift card to second swing. Dude, whose yellow ball was that that came up the... Oh, the one that just kind of rolled right All up? That was, that was Hildy. Mine was the one that almost killed you. All right, so by a margin of six inches, the winner is... Scott Klein. Scott Klein. Woo hoo! Real, real Scott. <laughs> All right. You know, Thank like, you very much. Now another fifty dollars. My teammate. So, hundred bucks a second swing. Thank you very much, Kevin. Just a couple weeks into the program, and we're already seeing big prizes, better scores, lower numbers on the scale, and a whole lot of fun going on. Next week, contestants will head back to the course for some head-to-head -head competition with a couple of hack to jack twists thrown in. Oh, and be sure to stick around after the credits to find out how you can get invited to join the contestants during a live upcoming filming. I am. I am. I am. I am. Hack to Jack. I am. I am. Hack to Jack. 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 Hack to Jack. I am. Hack to Jack. I am. Hack to Jack. I am. Hack to Jack. Boom. Oh, hey, welcome back. We're already approaching a million online impressions for this season and want to reward our loyal fans like you who are following along and would like to have you join us during a live upcoming filming. What do you have to do, you ask? Well, go to the Hack to Jack Facebook page. Give us your ideas on what you would like to see the contestants do on upcoming shows. If your idea is selected, you and a friend will get invited to join us when we film that. So go for it. Head over Facebook slash Hack to Jack now. Tell us what you'd like to see. Remember, we're not a stuffy country club, so we can actually have fun and do some wild and crazy stuff on the course. Be creative. Think outside the box. Share your ideas, and you might just find out how much fun it can be to be on Hack to Jack.